Okay, hi. How are we doing, guys? Well, this is not being an update. And I usually don't post on Sunday. On the weekends in general. I like those days to have for myself and for the family. But I just want to give you a quick update. The paint shop is almost done. You guys are going to see it probably tomorrow. It's, well, it's going to be a surprise. Let's not spoil it. And uh, this is what I want to talk to you about. I was trying to restore this rubber mat, original rubber mat. And it came out pretty good, but there's still some adhesive. It's not a big deal, I can take care of that. It's, but it's really flimsy. It bends in weird places to, you see like it's bubbling over here. It was worse than that. I soak it in warm to hot water, microwave it, and it helped some, but not a whole lot. So, I'm going to be replacing this. So what we're gonna do is we're gonna repaint the platter. It's already repainted, actually, it's drying as we speak. And we are going to replace that rubber mat with solid copper two millimeters mat. Okay, it's gonna look super nice, super cool. Add some weight. Okay, it's gonna look amazing. And uh, we are also going to address the uh, main spindle and the bearings. The bearings are, as you have seen in the previous videos, look really, really bad, really cheaply made. And uh, we're going to address that. Even though the speed test, as you saw, the disc spin for well over two minutes, which is fine. That's not an indicator on how well the turntable works, okay? That wasn't the point of the video. I mean, or was it? You know, that's not how you judge uh, the quality of the turntable. So we are going to replace it with a new uh, ball bearing. It's much, much better quality. It's got a nice groove on the bottom, on the top, and the bearings are much, much better quality than the uh, original one. It cost a lot more than uh, original bearing, I'm sure of that. Not gonna tell you how much was it. It wasn't a, uh, a lot, but for a little bearing like that, yes it was. Uh, let me just demonstrate this bearing at work. So we're gonna spend this two millimeter on copper platter on top of this bearing and as you can see in here yeah it's pretty silent it spins forever you know like literally forever you know this extra weight is gonna help with uh, momentum of the uh, platter I think it's gonna be better because original platter is only I believe 10 inches, maybe, maybe. So this is 12, almost 12. And uh, that's about it, I think. I've heard from someone that uh, Rachel Ghost gave us a shout out. Uh, great, I had a lot of fun on uh, Ghost Show. Great, keep it up, I mean, yeah, good fun is good fun. You know, nothing wrong with that. Uh, so thank you for the shout out. Uh, I'm still gonna be making videos about you guys because you suck. And that's it for now. I'll see you guys tomorrow. And hopefully we're gonna do a little reveal of Lafayette turntable after overhaul. Thank you. And the puppy the corn. The first step of the corn the shrimpies. Shrimpies. Little shrimpies. Oh, the 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 shrimpies. Oh, the
Attendez du sushi. Et des bains dans des potes. Et des candies de potes. Et des covers de champagne. Pour des boules et des boules et des boules et des boules. Mm-hmm. <sighs>